Good day, everyone. My name is Kevin Young, Techno Product Manager for Philips MMD in Europe. Today, I'm going to demonstrate you how our new USB-C docking monitor looks like in combination with daisy chaining and Windows Hello webcam. We are now connecting the USB-C cable from the Surface Pro to the monitor. When you connect our daisy chain setup for the first time, it is on clone mode and in the Windows display setting is also set to clone mode. In order to change the clone setting to extend setting, you go to the OSD menu, you go to the setup menu, and there you have an option display port out multi-stream. It's now set to clone. Set the display out multi-stream from cloning to extend. What you then need to do is go to the display settings of your monitor and change it from duplicate to extend desktop. You can now see there are three screens connected. So you set it to the preferred display setup. You press apply. It's now been identified as first screen, second screen, and third screen. Once that is done, press keep. Make sure that number three, the second monitor, is your primary in order to use the webcam later on to have it face toward you. So we set this as primary, and now this monitor is our primary screen. The advantage of USB-C docking monitor is that with a one cable solution, you will get display, you will get data, which is your keyboard and mouse or your USB stick, which is connect, and also internet via our RJ45 internet port, which you can see here. We go to connections, and here you can see that the Ethernet is on one gigabit speed, which is our gigabit internet port. The next demonstration I want to show you is how to use the Windows Hello webcam. When you open the camera application of Windows 10, you can see that the webcam has been selected. It could be that for the first time, the webcam of your laptop is selected, which you can see over here. You need to select it to the monitor webcam, close the camera application, and Windows 10 will remember the last camera option you have chosen. The advantage of the Windows Hello webcam of the 242B1H is that it's a pop-up camera, meaning that you can pop it back if you don't use the camera for security reasons. If you want to use the camera, press the camera, turn it 90 degrees, and the camera is popped out again. We are now going to show you how to set up Windows Hello Facial Recognition. Press Start. You go to Settings. You go to Accounts. You go to the Sign In Options. And you choose Windows Hello Face. It might be that you already set it up in the past. So in my situation, I will then press Improve Recognition. It could be also that you never set it before. Then you have the button Setup. Press get started. I fill in the passcode. And now you can see it is looking at your face in order to do facial recognition. You look at the camera, make sure that your face is nicely positioned. And it's now set. You can test it by logging off. You can choose either pin or use your face. You see the IR light is flashing, recognizing your face. 
and now you have logged in to Windows. The next thing what we are going to show is you have now set the camera model as your primary. If you want to set a different model to a secondary, you just need to go to the display setting and then set this to primary and now this monitor is primary. I'm now going to demonstrate you how to use a two cable solution on this monitor. The two cable solution is very handy if you are having a flash desk work environment where the desk has, is being used by multiple users with USB-C notebook and without USB-C notebook. In the situation where you don't have a USB-C notebook, you can either connect the DisplayPort cable to your surface and afterwards you'll get video on your daisy chained dual monitor screen. But the keyboard is not working. What you then need to do is connect the data cable. Take the USB-A dongle, you connect the dongle onto the USB-C connector and you connect the USB-A cable to your Surface Pro. Afterwards, you can see that the keyboard is working and you can also see if you choose the camera that the camera is working. And that is the demonstration I want to show you how to use the USB-C docking monitor with Windows Hello webcam. Thank you very much.